Chipotle. What are you gonna do, go to Taco Bell? <laughs> You can't create a successful restaurant chain without having some secrets, but Chipotle might have more than most. So here are 10 secrets about Chipotle you were never supposed to know. It's a secret. The Quesaritos. Quesadilla. A so-called secret menu is a part of many fast food chains, mostly because they give customers a bit of mystery and a sense of exclusivity. However, in the age of the internet and social media, most secrets don't stay secret for very long, and Chipotle's secret menu was no exception. And you should be no exception. Chipotle has a secret menu item that customers rave about, and it's called the quesarito. If it sounds like a combination between a quesadilla and a burrito, that's because it's exactly that. Picture your favorite Chipotle burrito stuffed with rice, cheese, and beans, along with your favorite grilled meat. Now picture the burrito blanketed by the warm, melty goodness of a cheesy quesadilla, and you have the tasty quesarito. Sounds delicious! Is a burrito wrapped in a quesadilla a step too far? At Chipotle, the burritos and the quesadillas are more than enough for a hearty meal, so this secret menu item seems particularly decadent, as well as delicious. This secret item seems like a good way for customers to try to get two meals for the price of one. It makes sense that this is one of the things Chipotle would have rather kept on the down low. It also makes sense that Chipotle wouldn't want every customer to order the secret quesarito. But having a secret menu item like this can cause some excitement, help increase customer loyalty, and increase the chances that they will keep coming back for more. I want more. Secret codes. I need the codes. Like a lot of fast food restaurants, Chipotle has secret menu items that customers in the know can order at their local outlet. But this fast food chain has taken things a step further with a couple of secret codes. Who's got the secret codes? The phrases three pointer and new button can be spoken by customers to get a less expensive version of a particular meal. Chipotle ranks ingredients by their cost when it comes to ingredients like guacamole, meats, and cheese. These ingredients are valued at two points by Chipotle. Cheaper ingredients, such as lettuce and rice, are assigned one point. When a customer orders a three-pointer, they're essentially ordering a customized bowl, burrito, or taco. This custom order will have several one-point ingredients, like beans and lettuce, and will only have a single two-point ingredient, like chicken or cheese. Exciting new ingredients. When you order a meal with fewer two-point ingredients than in a standard menu item, the result is a cheaper meal. It makes sense this would be one of the secrets about Chipotle you were never supposed to know. The chain wants customers to order as many of the two-point ingredients as possible because it makes more money this way. If too many customers used the secret codes to order cheaper versions of the menu items, it would probably start to put a dent in Chipotle's profits. You got, uh, you got my money? The seven. Seven, seven. Seven, seven. Customers are quick to notice when they feel like restaurants are being careful with the number of ingredients used when making the different menu items they offer. If it looks like chains like Chipotle are skimping a little bit on some coveted items like chicken and cheese, it's not your imagination. Not imagining anything. Chipotle has what chains call the critical seven. Barbacoa, shredded meat, chicken, carnitas, sour cream, cheese, guacamole, and steak. This list of critical ingredients includes the most expensive things to serve to customers, meaning they ration them out and charge customers extra if they want more. Can I have some more? The employees at Chipotle are trained to be careful when using the critical seven ingredients because if they are too generous with them, it could cost the company a lot of money. It makes sense that this would be one of the secrets about Chipotle you were never supposed to know. It wouldn't be very good for the fast food chain's image if customers believed they were being shortchanged when it comes to their favorite ingredients. Did you overcharge him too? Businesses like Chipotle are in a bit of a bind because they need to make money while also keeping customers happy so they keep coming back for more. Hopefully, now that this Chipotle secret is out, it can help strike a balance to keep everyone satisfied. Are you satisfied? Making your own burrito. I've made it myself. Chipotle's burritos aren't exactly small, but for people with big appetites, they just might not be enough to satisfy. Luckily for these customers, there is an alternative that most people probably didn't even know about. 
I didn't know. Instead of ordering a burrito, you can order a burrito bowl along with a side of tortillas. You can often get these tortillas for free, so this can be a good deal for customers. With the amount of food you get with the burrito bowl and the tortilla, you can make several burritos instead of settling for just one. That way, not only will you fill your stomach up to the fullest, but you'll also probably have enough left over for another meal. I were just wondering uh, where the leftover food is. Some locations will charge you for the side of tortillas, but even if they do, this still makes for a pretty good deal. However, it might not be such a good deal for Chipotle. The company would rather you order one of the standard burritos so they don't have to keep giving out free tortillas to customers. It simply isn't cost effective to let people have almost twice as much food for about the same price as a regular burrito. Chipotle could close this loophole by always charging customers for the side of tortillas. Until it does this, though, making your own burrito is a secret worth knowing when you show up to Chipotle with a big appetite. You've given me a big appetite. Getting more guacamole. Ooh, guacamole. Guacamole is one of the things Chipotle charges customers for when they ask for extra. Unfortunately, this has been a sore point for some customers who like a lot of guacamole. A little extra guacamole can cost you a couple of dollars. But luckily, there is a way for guacamole lovers to get more without having to pay more because I want to pay less. Some Chipotle employees recommend that you buy a vegetarian burrito, taco, or bowl. When you order these menu items with ingredients like chicken, beef, or pork, you get charged extra for guacamole. Remember, I told you there'd be an extra charge. However, the vegetarian versions of these menu items are served with free guacamole. This doesn't seem quite fair to meat lovers who wouldn't be happy with the vegetarian versions, but it does give customers an incentive to order the vegetarian options if they want to satisfy their craving for their favorite green topping. Chipotle's guacamole is made fresh every day with ripe avocados and other ingredients, which in the end might make it worth it to choose a vegetarian meal. You might be wondering why this is one of the secrets about Chipotle you were never supposed to know. Well, if too many customers came in and got free guacamole, not only would the restaurant chain lose out on some money, but it would quickly run out of the popular topping. Low on bean, I repeat, I'm low on bean! Scandal. Oh, wow. scandalous! Most companies have had to deal with some scandal at some point, so it's important to be able to deal with it as effectively as possible and move on. Unfortunately, it seems like Chipotle has had to deal with more than its share of scandals over the last few years. The fast food chain's troubles started back in 2015, when Chipotle was hit with 350 reported cases of food poisoning spread across 11 different locations. Food poisoning. Gross! After this serious wake-up call, you would think the chain would have gone out of its way to clean up its mess. But no, the chain was in for even more trouble as it was hit with more food poisoning cases in 2017 and 2018. Food poisoning scare sweeps city! Chipotle was associated with 700 cases in 2018, causing a lot of unwanted media attention that hurt the company's bottom line. The 2018 outbreak led to several lawsuits arguing that Chipotle had allowed unsafe food handling practices to be used in many of its stores. In 2020, Chipotle agreed to settle the lawsuits for $2.5 million and admitted to allowing some poor safety practices to go on in the restaurants that should have been corrected. It's obvious why this is one of the secrets about Chipotle you were never supposed to know. However, the chain was able to deal with the scandal and eventually get past it. Move on, move on. The Cilantro Lime Rice. Rice, I need to find some rice. Cilantro lime rice is a very popular item at Chipotle and has become so popular that a lot of people have tried to recreate it at home in their own kitchens. However, many of these people have reported disappointing results when they made it themselves. It doesn't seem like a simple rice dish would be hard to get right, but they are missing an important ingredient. To find his most important ingredient. 
Even though it's called cilantro lime rice, the recipe actually calls for equal parts lemon juice and lime juice instead of just lime juice. Many people think fresh cilantro is the key, but according to the people at Chipotle, the difference maker is the lemon juice. We uh, think we use lemon juice? The combination of the two citrus fruits instead of one results in a more tangy and a more tasty rice dish than what people have been trying to cook up at home. This is a secret you were never supposed to know because Chipotle wants you to go to its restaurants and buy its cilantro lime rice from them. But since the secret of the lemon juice in the cilantro lime rice is out, home chefs can give this tasty recipe another try and see if they can get it to taste like their favorite Chipotle side. Personal favorite. This restaurant chain has a lot of experience making cilantro lime rice, so maybe people would be better off just visiting their local Chipotle location when they get a craving for this popular dish. Do you, do you have cravings? Potent margaritas. A margarita? Where are we? What is happening? A good margarita goes hand in hand with Mexican food, and Chipotle understands this. You might seek out good margaritas at an authentic restaurant in Mexico, but it turns out you can find them closer than you'd think. Not every location serves margaritas because they need to get a liquor license, but about 900 Chipotle outlets do serve refreshing drinks to thirsty customers. Uh, I'm very thirsty. In case you thought the fast food chain would put out a sub par margarita that would disappoint, you will be relieved to know the truth. Chipotle makes their margaritas with quality ingredients like Patron, Triple Sec, Agave Syrup, and fresh squeezed lemon and lime juice. In bars, people often wonder if they're watering down the drinks and giving customers less alcohol. But Chipotle, on the other hand, has been faced with the opposite problem, with customers often complaining that the margaritas were much stronger than they were expecting. Perhaps this is a good problem to have, but many customers just don't expect a potent margarita at a chain restaurant. Oh, I didn't expect that. Chipotle doesn't want to scare its customers away with a drink that's too strong, but they also want to put a quality product on the menu it can be proud of. These quality margaritas seem like a great compliment to Chipotle's tacos, bowls, and burritos. Eat for each other? <gasps> Hiring employees. I wonder who's hiring. Chipotle's employees are a critical part of what makes the restaurant chain a success. The reasons why certain people are hired over others is not something Chipotle advertises a lot. Hiring an experienced staff. This chain is proud that the service customers receive is consistent regardless of the location, and a lot of work has gone into making this happen. Regardless of the position a person applies for within the company, there is a list of 13 characteristics that are considered when deciding who and who not to hire. Some of these sought-after characteristics include enthusiasm, intelligence, honesty, and curiosity. It does have some human characteristics. This set of characteristics seems like the qualities all employers would want their workers to have. Who doesn't want honest employees rather than dishonest ones? She'll appreciate your honesty. It's fine to have high expectations for one's workers, but it really comes down to just how effective Chipotle actually is at hiring and retaining the kind of people the company is looking for. With Chipotle employees often getting good marks based on customer feedback, it seems like the company has done a pretty good job of giving the people what they want. While it's understandable that a company would want to keep its hiring practices confidential, it seems like revealing this secret would only help Chipotle Chipotle's image with its customers. The customer is always right. Free meals for employees. It's about perks. Working at a fast food chain like Chipotle can be hard work, so the employees obviously deserve some perks. One of these perks is free meals for employees. This used to be common in the restaurant business, but a lot of them have cut back on this or simply dropped it entirely just so they could save some money. This is to save money. But at Chipotle, every employee is entitled to one free meal of their choice per shift, which includes any of the burritos, bowls, and tacos. The free meals for employees also include tortilla chips and even guacamole. A free meal is a decent perk and is appreciated by employees. It's much appreciated. This free meal comes in handy during a long day and helps set up the employees to be productive for the rest of the shift. The employees also have the option of getting a 50% discount 
count on the food they buy to take home with them after they're done working. I can't wait to eat. This makes sense because some people just want to wait until after their shift and eat when they get home. Why would free food be one of the secrets of Chipotle? Perhaps Chipotle executives were concerned that if customers knew that employees get free meals, customers would want the occasional free meal too. However, customers should not begrudge Chipotle's employees their free meals because they should understand that it's all part of a hard day's work. We work hard. We play hard first time here? Then leave us a comment and hit that subscribe button. And for another great video, just tap or click.